so in today's video i thought i'll do something very different compared to what i usually do so um i just received this deck uh, in my uh, mailbox which is the new deck uh, not it's not new actually <laughs> i just find it out uh, a deck from an artist called uh, named naomi uh, cornock uh, and her website is this one that's where I actually ordered it uh, from her um, she was also kind enough to uh, change you know the label uh, so that you know it doesn't say like Oracle uh, on my um, shipping label but anyway so um, the feeling of the uh, package feels very smooth and nice I think it's actually quite um, thick cardboard compared to um, the one I have from uh, the Golden Art Nouveau Tarot um, it's a little bit thicker uh, on this one just a little bit um, so let's see you have a little bit detail here so pretty also the bag came with it which I'm very thankful so let's see so first we got the um, booklets inside we have uh, here we have all the um, page number uh, of each car and the meaning of it with the introductions and we have uh, three category of um, meanings or different interpretation so we got each one of them uh, you can't find it like uh, down in the description box you may find the uh, uh, timestamp uh, to uh, go uh, directly uh, for each card but I'll just flip through it for those who may have um, lost on the booklet because it does happen to me and whenever I try to find uh, somebody like a PDF and something it's always like uh, some type of malware or some shit so here's a video so we got the first one you can pause the video of course here page, page 4 renew and horse freedom Page six and seven, healing stones connect author and playful. Page eight and nine, dragons kernel elemental, the dance lovers. Healing ancestor reflects a Pona tribe. Look at this, I'll go a little bit uh, faster. So there you go. Here, this one, I hope I didn't miss any pages. pages and lastly journeys end so there you go for the booklet and now I'll start with each card so we got here sacred journey so much details it's so pretty look at those community with these two wolves and the moon oh, 
cope with these two little birds. It's so cute. Renew, my favorite. It's so pretty. I just love it. The way it's drawn, the whole like um, scenery. Uh, also, the way the cards feel, it's quite um, s slippery. So I think if you shuffle, you know, on the side, it may like um, fly out quite easily. Um, the thickness is similar to my uh, golden Arnovo Tarot, but since it has that slippery texture, so it may be a little bit thicker, but it's definitely like it's definitely a uh, like minor difference so let's say it's the same freedom got connect playful so cute elemental can see here a dragon's face I just love the way you could all interpret this differently lovers so it's definitely like a deck that um, I think if you're somebody who loves symbolism uh, and like to interpret different things then it's definitely for you tribe Foresight Transform Protection I love this card It's so pretty And so cute I just love it The bear uh, totem animal Is definitely someone something that I resonate with strength this one looks like it came out of a uh, princess mononoke uh, movie i love it we got sovereignty we got ground growth Look at with the amount of details in this drawing, you even have runes here. Uh, I'm not familiar with runes, so maybe some of you know. I just love how you can interpret uh, all of it differently if you have different... Uh, if you know different meanings of uh, different symbols that you see here. World. There's actually somebody here, I feel like. Wisdom, so beautiful. With the watercolor and the ink, it's like, it marries so well. And gentle. Heart, hearts. With different runes here, we got Taurus and this sign that I forgot what it was. Bounty. Knowledge. Fears. Illuminates Clarity
pathways cleanse battle ready the death injure there are so many runes, uh, imagery and symbols I think I need to study that a little bit better we have death love this interpretation of this I mean the way she uh, drew this grief oh the cat it's so funny and lastly journeys and what a way to end this deck it's so cool so conclusion um definitely recommend uh, this i haven't used it yet so i can't wait to use it for my pick a card readings um, I think it's definitely one that you could uh, use for interpretation if you're somebody who loves to be like um, in the like uh, how do you say like uh, theory and like being very like I don't know like uh, this means this and that's it then um, I don't know like maybe not but I feel like it's more like for interpretations uh, although there is the booklet, I feel like you could definitely have a, have a lot of uh, way to play with these cards. So yeah, and it's quite slippery, it's quite um, the size, wait, I have the Sacred Destiny Oracle here. So it's a little bit um, bigger, I mean I'll say, yeah, it's definitely longer here, just like maybe a centimeter maybe two centimeter a centimeter and a half uh, approximately um, i mean i have small hands so it may be a little bit hard for me to shuffle let's see oh, wait <laughs> definitely slippery cards so yeah that's um uh, i guess that's the down uh, side of it if you see it as a downside but i have small hands so for me it's quite easily to easy to uh, make everything sleep so yeah but i'll find a way no problem so yeah i hope you like this video leave me a comment down below if you think uh, you'll get it what you think about it uh, if you have it with you so yeah i'll leave her uh, website down below and i'll see you next time bye